and this will be the play of the day. The monster showdown Saturday night, Michigan at Notre Dame. Notre Dame one and a half, 46 and a half the total. Come on, Jim Harbaugh, show me game. One and seven against top 10 teams. Last year, lost to Michigan State, Penn State, Wisconsin, South Carolina, and Ohio State. He is nine and eight in his last 17 games. He's two and seven against Ohio State, Michigan State, and in the bowl games. He finally has a quarterback. All, all we hear about is Patterson's going to be terrific. He got a, concerns about the wide receiver position. It is a nasty defense. It's a show me game for Harbaugh. You got to do it here. Hell of a matchup. And, and, you know, Notre Dame's got a pretty good defense as well, but they lost their defensive coordinator, Elko, who took off and went to AM. Can you trust Wimbush as well, who was erratic at quarterback? Kelly has said both, he might play both guys at quarterback, but to me, put up or shut up time for Harbaugh. You know, Teddy, you went to Michigan. They pay him a ton of money. He's got to deliver on the stage now. No, he doesn't. See, the whole, like, Jim Harbaugh's got to do this. No, he doesn't. This is what Jim Harbaugh has to do. He has to stay at Michigan. The program is fine. The state of the program is fine. Last year, they've had quarterback problems. No question. The offense went from, what, 40 points a game down to 25 last year. A huge drop-off offensively. The offensive line play wasn't there. The QB play was there. Now they got Shea Patterson. And make no mistake about it, Shea Patterson, NFL upside, a stud when healthy. Uh, in uh, uh, Mississippi, uh, no question. Last year, what do you have? Uh, 2,200 passing yards, 17 scores uh, before uh, suffering that season ending knee injury. You know, but Tariq Black hurt for Michigan. He's out and definitely do a foot injury. That's an impact injury for the Wolverines. At Notre Dame, officially, you're talking about Wimbush. Let's not forget, you know, they lost Quentin Nelson and Mike McGlinchkey. To the off, uh, you know, from their offensive line, two top 10 picks from one college offensive line. One would think this year's offensive line is going to be a step or two down from that unit. But boy, you look at these two defenses. Wolverines loaded. Notre Dame lost their coordinator, as you mentioned, but certainly uh, they are a team yep. that has enormous defensive talent. Not a team that uh, you would expect to be all of a sudden giving up points in bunches, even to a quarterback like Shea Patterson. Like the show? Help us keep the lights on. Please make sure to comment, share, and subscribe to all the Sportsbook Review videos. Thanks so much. Best of luck. Enjoy the game.